The Queen reveals heartbreak in touching message to Indonesia. The Queen has sent a touching message to Indonesia after a deadly tsunami struck the Sunda Strait. The Queen and Prince Philip sent their condolences to Indonesia following the tsunami on Saturday, which left at least 373 people dead and more than 1,400 injured. An eruption of an island volcano sent a 20 meter high wall of water inland damaging houses and hotels. Undersea land slips from the eruption of Anak Krakatau, an island formed from previous blasts from Krakatoa, were recorded 24 minutes before the tsunami struck at around 9.20 p.m. on Saturday local time. In a message to the President of Indonesia and the Indonesian people, the monarch said, Prince Philip and I were deeply saddened to learn of the loss of life following the devastating tsunami in Indonesia. We send our sincere condolences to all who have lost loved ones, and those whose homes and livelihoods have been affected. I pay tribute to the courage and dedication of the emergency services and the volunteers that are providing support. The FCO has updated travel advice saying people in the area should follow the advice of local authorities. It advises that before traveling to the coastal areas of western Java and the south of Sumatra, people should also check with their travel operator and monitor local media. Indonesia, which sits on the Pacific Ring of Fire, has suffered its worst annual death toll from disasters in more than a decade. Devastating earthquakes hit parts of the island of Lombok in July and August, and an earthquake and tsunami killed more than 2,000 people on a remote part of Sulawesi Island in September. The timing of the tsunami, over the Christmas holiday season, brought back memories of the Indian Ocean tsunami triggered by an earthquake on December 26, 2004, which killed 226,000 people in 14 countries, including more than 120,000 in Indonesia.